what is going going on guys welcome 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 to my channel my name is mars tuning we are going to tune the super up so excited so 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 excited guys because you can put so much horsepower in this thing you can make it so fast i'm gonna show you guys the full build on this thing i'm gonna show you guys the tune on it i'm gonna show you guys how to launch it i'm gonna show you guys how to trap almost 200 miles per hour real wheel drive and let's get right to it everybody new to the channel hit that subscribe button and we are going to get this party started so i got right here guys the 1998 toyota supra rz edition uh, this vehicle is amazing they did so much good stuff with it and i am going to show you all of it let's go straight to the upgrades straight to custom upgrades i like to get right to the needy and greedy so let's go right here we're going to leave the original engine if anybody swaps this car you are missing out please do not swap this car please 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 do not swap this car um, we have the v8 there we got a turbo rally i don't know why uh, we have the uh, 7 2 which that is nasty of a motor but we're not going to do that and we have the v12 which blah 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 all right let's back out of that let's go right here car is rear wheel drive and the best thing you can do is put that single turbo in there back in the older games a single turbo actually gave you less weight uh, single turbo actually spooled up a little bit better and then it gave it a lot you know the whole theories with the whole game but single turbo let's back out like that let's back out again let's go right over here let's start it up so we have the intake fully built it that's fully 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 built this thing I'm so excited guys I got the paint job on there I mean it's just gonna be sick 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 I already I just brought it out to the uh, the track and I already raced like some kids I already had theirs but have no idea what they're getting into this guy this tune right here is really nice it's really nice all for you guys so we have nice 1601 horsepower a torque of 1327 foot pounds of torque car weighs 2590 pounds what that is that is that is pretty good pretty pretty good let's put that race suspension and yes Rally suspension is the softest suspension, best suspension to put on these drag cars. The soft suspension distributes all that horsepower from the front to the back. It initially lifts up the car, and then all that power just distributes all the way to the back, which gives you ah, amazing, amazing results. So let's get that. Let's put that there. Um, no roll cage. Forget about the roll cage. Let's fully weight reduct it, and that's how you got that 24, 2,500 pounds on there. And then let's put all these parts on there. Very, very easy. There we go. There we go. And there we go. Alrighty, now the best part tires. Let's put those drag tires on there. That's the only way. I mean, I, I don't understand how people make a drag build and they don't put drag tires. I seem like uh, one of the YouTubers didn't put drag tires. That's kind of not okay. Front tire width 235s, real thin. And on the back tire width, really nice. Look at those. Oof, that stance in the back. Look at those tires. They're poking out of that fender 345 is in the back uh remember lightest weight wheels guys just put the lightest weight wheels i got these wells on there so it looks like a professional drag car uh but this remember this tune is for the street so it's pretty much a street drag tune uh nothing with the size of the wheels is leaving at 17s no spacers in the front full spacers in the rear give it that whole aggressive look and uh oh my god body wise you can put all these bumpers on there and stuff it just looks so 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 nice you can put like that you know or that one that looking fast and furious blah 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 but these bumpers right here these oh my god this fast and furious edition from horizon 2 front bumpers um and all that stuff with the lip and everything you can put a carbon fiber you can put it with the uh with the, with the diffusers and all that uh, nothing with the oh I did take off the spoiler I did take off the spoiler on it um, it reduces the weight on it so of course let's take that off on there even though I like it with the spoiler but let's take it off did not put no back bumper no side skirts and I did put the hood uh, reduces more weight as well so that is it with the build let's go straight to the tune guys car is doing a whopping 1.690 0 to 60 remember this is a street tune it's not a drag tune so if you take it to the drag track uh it will not perform the same as when you take it to the street uh this since this is a car you can take out to the street you can go to the highway roll race with it you can you know go to the strip drag race with it and you can do pretty much anything with this one 
Um, then that 0 to 100 is at 3.2. Car topping out about 273. And uh, now, oh, that tire pressure, guys. Very important. Front tire pressure is at 45. So if you have it really inflated, you barely want those front tires to touch the ground. The back, you want it 15%. Take out some of that air. You want all that back tire to grip as much as it can. Here goes the gearing, guys. 220 final drive. First gear, 305. Second gear, 204. And third gear, 145. Beautiful three gear tune. If you guys see what this car traps at, oof, you guys will be amazed. Uh, so we got 1.5 on that front. Remember, that positive camber, less footprint, less those front tires are touching the ground, the better. And then we have a 0.4 in the back. So once with the car squats down, it uh, that camber would adjust itself just a slight bit. And then we have uh, 7 on there in that angle, 65, 65. Then we have soft in the front at 137, stiff in the rear at 505. Car raised all the way up. Very, very nice. And again, soft in the front, stiff in the rear. Remember, we want this car to initially lift up, up from the ground, grip those back wheels, and then just take off. So we got 1.5, 6.5, 1.5, 6.5. Nothing with the arrow. Uh, if you want to do reverse burnouts, you can put this all the way to uh, 0 or 5 or 10%. Uh, you can get reverse burnouts and then we have at 100 and 100 so let's save that there let's back out let's take it straight to the track i hope it's not raining it is not it is not raining let's go fast travel over there we already got a couple people over there at the track they're probably already drag racing some of these people have them all-wheel drive some people don't i mean it's, it's kind of i don't like that i mean a lot of people because of all the options they gave them uh, that's what's happening. So uh, the sound of the car, <sighs> the sound of the car, I really don't like it. I'm sorry, guys. But besides that, the car, 1600 horsepower, the blowout valve, the turbos. Oh my God, that sounds really good. But it, it kind of doesn't sound like Horizon 2 or Horizon 1 Supra. That Supra was amazing. Alrighty, guys. To launch the car, you're gonna press down on the e brake, which is A. Then you're going to press down on the gas so you can have the gas press all the way down. It holds about 2,000 RPMs. Now you press down on the clutch and then on and off the e-brake. You want it to go to about 5,000 RPMs. If you do press down the telemetry here, you got a torque of 184, boost of negative one pound. I don't know why uh, the boost is like that, but that should have actually boost on there. But the way that this engine is, uh, that's how it's going to be. Now all you got to do is let go of the clutch and the e-brake. If you do a burnout, it'll grip more. But look at this. Ugh, traveling 196 miles per hour and 195. It'll average about 195, 196 consistently there, guys. Three gear tune. Car. Oh my god, this thing. Look at everybody. Everybody has this car. Has it out on the track. It's trying to do some numbers with it. And uh, I'm just like, you know so 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 excited so remember a 5k launch with it and then that'll be the best way and look he's spinning he doesn't know what to do until he sees this video he'll know exactly what to do Woo, look at that <laughs> alrighty guys so everybody new to the channel hit that subscribe button you guys are gonna keep seeing more drag tunes I'm gonna keep showing you guys all of my tricks and tunes and all that good stuff uh, everybody on the comments down below let me know what you guys are thinking about this car what you guys feeling about it the sound uh, uh my little off with the sound with the blow up out the turbo how that that, that spools of choo -choo 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 sounds really good uh yeah guys hit that subscribe button i'll see you guys around with another drag 2 video peace out everybody